Oh, it's a nice foggy morning here in Alabama. I'm gonna go down to my lean-to. I hadn't been down there in a while. I got that little pack that I told y'all I had all packed up with cooking stuff so I could just grab it and go. Uh, I got a morning where I uh, don't have the kids, so I'm gonna come down and cook. If the rain holds off, it's supposed to storm all day, so we'll see, but uh, hopefully my little lean-to will keep the rain off of me and I'll just cook a little breakfast, have a little quiet time. And I'll have some, I would say we'll have some campfire talk, but everything's so wet, I got enough stuff in here. I'm either going to use my alcohol burner or my gas burner under the lean-to, and I'm maybe cook an egg. And I got some spam and different stuff, but we'll cook something and I'm just have a good time. And I'm thank y'all for being down here with me. And I'm let's get on down to the lean-to and uh, or over to the lean-to and I'm cook some breakfast. Pretty dry under here. Man, it's been months since I've been down here, but I think I was boiling acorns. Got a little dry wood, but not much. I used to hang that up, but I don't see my hanger. All right, let's get some eggs going or something. Got a lot of stuff in this backpack. Got my Texas Pete. I may have to take his jacket off. I think I got everything in here. My cooker. I showed y'all that last week where I modified this grease pan. I put this lid on it. I got all my cooking stuff in there. And um, I even got a, I ordered this to go in there. To, oh, wrong way. Where you can hold it. I think that's pretty cool. I ordered some more that was real cheap. They actually, you can use them for tongs. I got them in my building, but they're pretty cool. Anyway, let's get this hooked up so we can get uh, some breakfast. Ordered this new Coleman burner. I got the lightweight ones that I use when I uh, backpack, but I really like these Coleman's. They're a little heavier, but I just, I like them. They're a lot heavier to use. That's my LT Wright Bushcrafter. Let's get some, I think, I normally use my little cup that's on my, uh, I got a cup on my grill, but I, I've been wanting to use this, so I'm gonna boil some water in this just to break it in. Make some coffee. Use this thing here to hold it. It's gonna be cool. It's got some paper writing on the side here. That'll probably got my coffee well, cup. Well. I've been bringing this plastic one instead of my kooksa, because you can't drink out of your cup that you're cooking in. It's too hot. So, I mean, you can let it cool off, but I like to drink mine. So, I just put this in there, and I keep my kooksa in my other backpack. But I'm carving a new one right now in my building out of cedar. And on, it's going to be cool, so I'll actually have two. That's my problem, is I try to make two of everything and have these different packs ready. And, on, you know, I shouldn't do that. I should have it all out on the shelf, and each time I go down there, just, just repack a pack. Or not repack a pack, but put what I need in it. But uh, I kind of like the way this one is now, where I can just grab it and go. But, like, it's, it's overpacked because I've got an alcohol 
the Transia alcohol stove in it. Then I got this burner in it. And then I've got a, a, the stuff for a, like a, a little wood stove. So, you know, uh, kind of overkill. But I like to have everything in it so I can just grab it and go. So, but all that's in there is cooking stuff. So, you know, I don't have sleeping stuff and stuff like that. Uh, I, I'll probably go, uh, it's raining, so I should have brought my, uh, my poncho, I guess. But this thing, I put this, I, I extended this out about two foot so that it would, you know, when I'm sitting here, it'll keep me covered. So if it starts raining real hard, you know, we may have to fold it up, but uh, maybe we'll be good. Got some good bowl going. Woo, found my soldiers. Good stuff. Woo -wee. It's hot too. I don't know how I got lucky and measured that just right. Now I'm gonna get my stuff ready to cook for the egg. I'm a little skillet. I seen an egg flipper on the internet the other day. I know most of y'all people make fun of people who can't flip an egg, but this one's a spatula and it's got a fork. So you stick it in there and you hold it and you can flip your egg. I seen a guy on the internet making fun of the people that couldn't flip eggs, said they wasn't a good cook, but uh, I struggle with flipping the eggs. And I always use a small skillet. I'm glad I opened this because I put this in there this morning when I brought it down here. And it but when I put the top down, it busted. So I'm glad I got that one quick. Now let me get my oil. Old baby food thing. I also got some spam. Probably should have cooked it first, maybe. But I'll cook the egg first. Find my spatula real quick. Rain's holding off, that's good. I don't think I got anything to eat out of it. I guess I could put it in my bowl that I cooked, cooked in just then. Love these little burners. When it's wet like this, you know, this makes it easier. Cause there ain't nothing out here dry. It's been raining. Well. Got a little behind because I got cheese that I should have cut it. But I'm just going to break it up in little pieces. Woo. It's already burning, I think. And I'm going to put a few jalapenos in there. Whoop.
Yeah, almost left them on there too long. Getting a little bit too brown, but it's gonna be okay. I like mine a little bit brown, a little bit like that, but that's that's really too much. But I'm not an expert. <laughs> <coughs> Woo, those jalapenos are strong. I think I'll put it on my cedar board. Then we're gonna cook some spam. Oh yeah, that cheese melted good. Found my spam. I found one of my snap together bowls in here. So I get my It lays flat and then you snap it and then you can eat out of it. So I can put my eggs and stuff in here. Mmm, that's gonna be good. Alright. Now I'm gonna cut my spam up. We'll get my my opal. I always forget to get my opal out, but I ain't today. That baby is sharp and um, it's fun to use. I'm just going to cut it into a couple of pieces that I can handle in my little skillet. Then I'll put my jalapenos and cheese. Get this cooked real quick. Right. All right, I'm putting my cheese, put cheese and jalapenos in there. Good stuff. Oh yeah. I'm 
All right. Man, I'm glad y'all down here with me today. We got cheese, jalapenos, and we got eggs and jalapenos. It's gonna be good. Get my fork. I got a bamboo fork somewhere. Oh well. Might eat with my tweezers. Ooh, that's gonna be hot. Let me see what my eggs taste like. Mmm. Man, that is awesome. Oh man, that's delicious. Thanks for being down here with me today. I'm gonna finish eating this. I brought my Bible, I'm gonna do some quiet time and I'm gonna finish my breakfast and I'm just enjoy the rest of this day. It's, it's a, I know it's rainy, but it's, it's still a good day to get out. Just, just if you get a chance to get out, have fun, get out in the outdoors, just make it happen. I didn't have a lot of time today and I just got this little pack fixed where I could just shoot out the door and you know, come down here, I just happened to have this little lean-to that I built last year. And um, normally I like to build a fire and do bushcraft, more bushcraft stuff. But anyway, thanks for being down here with me today. And remember what I always say, keep God first, Creek Camper out.